So if you want to train any artificial neural networks or deep learning, uh, machine learning uh, algorithms in Python, uh, you need uh, two packages to be installed. The very first one is TensorFlow, uh, which is a library. And then uh, the other one is uh, Keras, which is an API that allows you to communicate with that library. Uh, let's first see what happens if you don't have those packages installed. So when you open up a, a Jupyter Notebook and you, for example, type in import TensorFlow uh, and, and run it, you will see that there is no module named uh, TensorFlow. So what we have to do is to go and click on environments and then create a new environment. We are going to call it TF. And uh, once that is created, you can go ahead and install a bunch of packages within that environment. Well, let me actually give it a better name. So TensorFlow. And let me use Python 3.10 because that is the Python version that I have installed on this machine. And you see that the TensorFlow library is going to be created here for me. And once you're there, you can click on not installed and search for TensorFlow. And also when you search for that, Keras would also be there. So you can, I think, uh, Okay, choose both of them and then click on apply so that both would be installed within this environment. So it gives me this error. Let's see if uh, I just install TensorFlow, if it still gives me this error or not. So instead of uh, installing them at the same time, I'm going to install them one by one. All right, still gives me the error. And the reason it seems like that it is the incompatibility with the Python version that I have and the TensorFlow, because you remember I chose uh, Python 3.10 and it goes to 3.9. So what I'm going to do is to uh, create a new environment. So I'm going to create a new environment I'm just going to call it TF new. And for my Python, I'm going to go with 3.9.7. So I create that. And by the way, I can go ahead and remove this TensorFlow environment. I'm not doing it right now because it's going to take a bit uh, of time. So just go with the TF dash new. And you can call this environment whatever you want. It really doesn't matter. All right, and now that I am in tf.new, in the not installed TensorFlow, I find that and then click on apply. And it gives me a bunch of things that would be changed, which is okay, I just click on apply. All right, and it got installed. Now, the other thing that I need is the Keras, so I'm going to apply that as well. Just click apply. All right, now they're both installed. So if you uh, look for TensorFlow in among the installed packages, you see that you have the Keras and also TensorFlow in your TF-new environment. You can go ahead and actually uh, remove this uh, older one that uh, you, was not working because of the incompatibility between Python version and, uh, and TensorFlow. So I'm just going to remove it right away. All right, and it's now uh, removed. So I have uh, base and uh, tf-new, so I go to home, and in the applications on, now I go on tf-new, and I launch notebook from the applications that I have in tf-new. And the thing is that Jupyter Notebook is not installed, so first you have to click on install. All right, and now that it is installed, I can launch it. create a new Jupyter notebook and let's see 
import tensor flow as tf and see if it runs now and it runs without any error so now you have uh, tensor flow and if you want to see carrots is here as well you can say from tensor flow import keras and it runs without any errors now you are ready to run any code that you want with regards to tensorflow and keras